Good morning, everyone. <laughs> Happy Wednesday, September 13th. Yesterday, I took the day off. I had an ultrasound during the day, so I didn't want to get um, an afternoon sub because they're really, really hard to get. And um, so I just took the entire day off. I figured it was much easier on everyone if I just took the whole day because for some reason, afternoon subs, they either take the job and then realize it's just the afternoon and they change their mind and they drop out and then everyone's scrambling. So I just took the whole day off and it was much easier for everyone. So I'm eager to see how my kids did and see the sub report and see if they cleaned up after themselves and everything like that. So I will show you guys when I get to work. But I am going to stop at Starbucks this morning because I'm leaving a little bit earlier than normal because I did my hair last night and I just threw on some powder and um, I actually like <clears throat> normally my alarm is set for 515 and I literally snooze it until 6 and this morning I well last night I set my alarm for 545 and then this morning I only snoozed my alarm once so I think that there's something to that like I got an extra 30 minutes of sleep that wasn't like anticipating anything so I think tonight I'll set my alarm for like 550 that way I can only snooze once because I'll I'll only snooze if I know I can afford it like I won't snooze if I know that I need to eat up so I'm gonna try that tonight also I'm running to Starbucks because Mandy from I think she's from a few vlogs ago um, she did my bus duty yesterday and she does not want me to repay her with um, me doing her duty. So I told her I would um, bring her Starbucks because I can do that. So as I am turning 32 weeks pregnant this week, um, the whole you need a plan for a sub thing has hit me and <laughs> um, I'm kind of not excited about it. Um, as we all know as teachers, planning for subs is a lot more difficult than planning for ourselves because obviously we know, you know, what we're teaching, we know what strategies to use, we know which activities we want to do, and if we don't know, we know what resources to use to go and find those activities and those things that we want to use. Now as a substitute, depending on the sub, if they're you know, a retired teacher, then they probably do know the means to go and find those things. If they're just somebody that got a degree in something else and they're in limbo and they're not really sure what to do um, and they're subbing, then they really don't have, you know, a clue on how to plan for students or what to do to teach them certain things. So I'm trying to cross my fingers that I'm going to find somebody that's either A, trying to become a teacher so they'll want to plan and want to start looking into things for themselves without me having to do everything um, or somebody that's been a teacher before that knows what they're doing and that can plan for themselves now I do have every intention and I'm gonna start probably next week maybe the week after that I am gonna start planning a week at a time for my sub and because for me planning is easy it's my fourth year teaching fourth grade i know what to do i know what's coming i know what needs to be done so i don't feel like i need to sit down and like script out plans every week i can just i know my standard i know my objective i know what needs to be done so all i need to do is really list those things out for myself but for a sub i kind of do need to script things out and i kind of do need to go more in depth so i think i'm going to start planning for my sub one week at a time and try to get an entire month's worth of plans written up for the sub. Now the problem with it is that I really don't know when I'm going to start needing the sub because I really don't know when my son is going to want to come. Uh, so I guess I'm just going to plan for like I'll have two or three days of emergency sub plans that way. <laughs> Uh, I can, like, if I leave in the middle of the week, why are you, okay, um, they're not scrambling, and then I'll have a fresh week starting that next week over planned so that it's like, okay, this is what I'm teaching these kids, okay, so 
I'm gonna start doing that probably next week and then that way I have at least a month's worth of really good plans for the sub and then after that depending on who I get um, I'll be able to like plan along you know like after the first month, you know, the first month I'm gonna wanna spend not doing anything, just being with my sweet, sweet baby and my husband and just being present and not being at work at all. And then after the first month, I can just, you know, like sit down and plan, you know, during the day and have those plans like going up as needed. So like the first month, you know, then keep going after that and like I said depending on who I get they might know how to plan and having my plans might be a good start for them god the sun is freaking terrible I can't see anything hopefully no one's coming because geez it's awful uh so yeah maternity leave not as fun as you think <laughs> not for a teacher because it's so much work to get ready for it I feel like not only do I have to prepare for the baby to come but I also have to prepare for myself to leave. So it's like multiple, like, it's like double the work to prepare for a baby when you're a teacher. Uh, so yeah, that's real talk right now. Hey guys, so I just walked into my room and pretty good. It's clean. It's not put away like I normally do, but it's clean. It looks like they earned two oh yeahs and no oops. So they got their Tuesday. Here's the little note that I left for them. I see you, Jennifer! <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, you look cute. Why call Crystal? Me? No, um, Rachel. Oh. Uh, Rachel needs help with sit form, so I'm gonna help her. Oh, nice. I gotta do that. That's what I need to do. I found a Reese. <laughs> I haven't even read my little thing yet. I was getting ready to read it. But it looks like it was okay because it says, thank you for being so well organized. The class received a five in PE. They were well behaved in the hallways and had trouble focusing and having, and not have finished their work. You have wonderful students. Oh, yay! So I made sure to leave a really detailed schedule of everything and I left them a little note says, my super troopers, I'm sorry that I cannot be here today. I already miss you. Please follow all of your normal procedures and be kind to your guest teacher. You are all amazing and I know you will make me proud. Keep our room clean and be on your best behavior. I'm counting on you. Don't forget, I will be watching Class Dojo, so earn those points. I love you so, so much. Love, Darth Valdez. We have an inside joke. <laughs> uh, they're my super troopers and I'm Darth Valdez. Morning, William. Good morning. How are you? Good to know. <clears throat> and then I always just print out my sub plans on plan book because it's so nice and organized with times and everything. And then I give them a little letter that I write just kind of describing the day. And then these are my behavior expectations just in case they have questions about that. Um, so yeah, overall very good. And then what I normally do after a sub comes is I give this, this is my sub tub, but I don't really use it as a sub tub. <laughs> I give this substitute follow up form. And even though it has the wrong date on it, it's funny. This is the same sub that I had before, but it's the same girl as yesterday. But it's uh, like, how do you feel the day went? What did you learn that day? Were there any lessons that weren't completed or that you had trouble understanding? How was the behavior of the classroom? How was your behavior? Anything else you'd like to add about the class substitute or other issues? So it kind of gives all the kids a way of ratting out the stinkers. But from the note that I got from the sub, it looks like I only had two students that had a hard time. And it looks like it wasn't that hard of a time they just had trouble focusing and not finishing their work which they do that for me too so that's okay we'll just have a conversation so now I need to get ready for the day um, I just turned my computer on so we will see what's going on with the computer. 
hopefully the internet works because last time I was here, the network was not working and I literally could not get anything printed or anything and it was really frustrating. So <clears throat> yesterday they should have had an introduction to food webs and things like that because today we're gonna do a food web activity and I want them to be kind of versed in what food webs are, especially because we're going on a field trip on Friday and their topic is food webs. So this is an 87 page activity pack, but I'm probably not gonna use the whole thing. Anyways, I'm just getting ready for the day, so I'm gonna let you guys go and I will see you when I see you next. <laughs> This is the worst tripod ever. Look at my new button. Starbucks and Mickey Mouse memes. <laughs> Hi guys. Oh, you know what would be cool? Hmm. If we did Instagram, but why is like this? Ooh, we could do that. Hi guys. Um, they're looking for. We just, we, we just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got. I wonder who it's from. Actually, I know who it's from. It's from, it's from Remy. Remy. So thank you for sending us our very first package. And it and has the cutest duct tapes on the top. Yes, and I'm going to show you the bottom because uh, that way you don't see her address. But yeah. ours is just the P.O. box, so it's no big deal. But thank you so much for sending us our first package. Like we did not plan our outfits. No. Are you shocked? Mm -hmm. I should have worn my... Pumpkin spice one. If that's okay. So this is the packaging. Yeah, and we're talking pink. about. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh my gosh, I see fun mm -hmm. things already. I'm not even <gasps> trying to look. I'm like, I don't want to look. I don't want to look. I'm peeking. Mm -hmm. Are you the kid that shipped your presents on Christmas? I'm the kid that opened them and rewrapped them on Christmas. Ooh. I just looked at them. I'm the kid that set up the hidden camera. Ooh. She's nodding. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, yeah. let's just each randomly take a thing and then show it. Oh wait, oh, oh it says open me. Oh, <laughs> I'm good. This is so cool. Look how much really stuff cool. is in here. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Thanks, Thank Remy. Oh. Oh, there's purple writing. Alright, should we read it? Um, oh. <gasps> it's from Daiso! Wait, what? I love Daiso. There are some goodies from a store called... The Ooh. It's like a Japanese dollar store. Remy. Remy in the club. Okay, Ooh. so you guys have to go follow Remy. It's uh, Remy in the club. Remy underscore in the club. We will link her in the description yes. below. <laughs> so this is so fun. Okay, what did I pull out All right, first? I don't know. She gave us some pumpkin masking tape. Mm -hmm. Ooh, a folding bag hook. Ooh, is that for like on the table? Mm -hmm. It's a rose. Cute. Name holder. That would be perfect for field trips. Yes. You can also put it on backpacks. And she gave us two of them, 15 Yay! and 15. So you could totally like reuse these. Mm -hmm. You're going field trip on Friday. You should try that. <gasps> Look how cute these little easels are. <gasps> Remember, we wanted these from Target, but we didn't get yeah, them. But they didn't have work on the back. You could put pins back oh here. Oh my gosh, how cute! These this would be so, so cute, cute on your desk. It would. Oh my gosh. <gasps> I've always wanted these. I love Ooh, planning. Are these Look at the? These. They're like they're tabs, but they can <gasps> highlight things. <gasps> That's oh so gosh. cool. Mm -hmm. I love Daiso. Oh my gosh. There's two. Yay! These are message page. Okay, so these are the, oh, these are little, um, like, page post flags. it. Yeah. Cute. Oh, I don't even know what this is, but I like it. it, it, it are they like, like little cards? It. Yeah. Neon letters. Oh, cute. Oh, that's perfect for our notes that we haven't passed yet. We're going to write There's two of them. Thank you. Ooh. I've always wanted to try this. 
Tai Chi. Are these good? I don't know, but I've heard it and I've seen people make videos about mm. it and they're like, I'm gonna taste these. <gasps> Pineapple, Ooh, mango. Mm. Yo, I love mango flavored oh, okay. Yay, look at there's and another one. And there's another one. Oh my God. These are so cute. Oh my. You know who's gonna oh steal these is Presley, Nora, and Lily. Yes. They're gonna you be You know like who's gonna steal this one? Jordan. <laughs> She's in love with penguins. Mm. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Let's see. Oh, they're word cool. cards. Can you, are, are they, they like flashcards? It looks like they're it. They're blank. Oh, they're blank and you can make them into flashcards. Oh, that's cool. That's really, that's cool. really cool. I don't know what to use it for, but it's cool. Look. She gave us two of everything. These oh, are awesome. What's that? I don't know. Is it a laundry? I think so. Mesh clothes pin bag. Oh, you put your clothes pins in it. Oh, so when you're hanging up stuff? Cool. I bet you we could use this in class or something. Probably, yeah. Storing clothes pins, storing toys. You could store, um. Pause. Either that or like a center. <clears throat> oh, yeah, you could. It could be like. So cool. Ooh. Oh my God. What? I love those. Are they bendy? Yes. Bendy They're rollers. They're flexible rollers. Oh, flexible and they have seating. the circle things with the, um, <gasps> to trace. Oh, yeah. These are so Thank awesome. You. Remy, you're the best. Thank you, Remy. This we love so all cool. of our stuff. Now, we didn't make a peel box to get letters no. and gifts. We did it no. for more of business inquiries. Yes. So um, I'm actually going to be posting a review of something someone sent me um, very soon. But this was really nice. Yeah, yeah I don't even think my channel knows that I that we have a PO box yet. No, we have a PO box. Jennifer and I opened a PO box. I will link the address down below. Remind me to do that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thanks, Remy. This is so exciting. I love I'm excited. these. I like called her and I snapchatted her. I was like, we got a package. We just got. We, I didn't even. Ex I didn't even expect to get anything because we just did no. it for for business safety. Well, and also safety. I want to start doing giveaways. Yes. And if I'm sending stuff out, I feel like it's just safer mm -hmm. for you to put out yes. like a PO box number. Wait, why isn't this open? Ooh, it's like a center. There's like something inside. Cheers. Ready? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. That's so good. Oh my gosh, it's like juicy. This is gonna be gone today. Is it gum? No, it's a chew. It's a high chew. What's a high mean? High Hi. chew. Bless you. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Mm. Yum. Thank you.